You guys, this time I am in the city with it, okay? Make sure that you like, comment, and subscribe. You follow me on Instagram. And that you ring the bell so you don't miss an upload. And I just wanna say welcome, 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 welcome back to my channel. So it's a pretty day outside. It's nice weather, it's not too cold. But I wanna show you guys a little bit around the city and let you guys know what there is to do here in Atlanta. So if you're interested in seeing, just keep watching. Today is day, what is today? Today is day, I think, four. Day four of 25 days of travel, AKA Vlogmas. And you guys, I am here in the city and today I will be taking you on a daycation. So a daycation is a little bit different than a staycation because I'm technically not staying anywhere, but I am gonna explore my city of Atlanta, Georgia, and I'm gonna take you guys along with me. So some of the things that I have planned for today are Christmas related activities. I'm gonna try a new restaurant. I'm going to just, like I said, explore my city. So if you are ready to go on this journey with me, keep watching. market and this is one of like the cutest like little marketplaces here in the city in Atlanta and I am actually here because I am going to do some taste testing at some of their restaurants so the first place I'm going to try is called El Super Pan and it is like a Cuban slash Puerto Rican type of restaurant and then I'm gonna try a few other places but I'll let you know let you guys know what I try and how it is so this is like my little food tour and then I'm probably going to head out and explore more in the city but like I said I'll let you guys know what I try how it is so on and so forth so talk to you guys soon <laughs> So to be honest, you guys, the quesadilla was actually really good, but I was disappointed with how it was packaged. So yeah. <laughs> Technically, this would be brunch, but I'm super excited to try it, and I'm super 
excited for you guys to see. So just a word of advice, if you do come here, make sure that you reserve your table online because they do most of the time have like a two to three hour wait. So that's just a tip. And I will leave the link to where you can make your reservations at. But like I said, once the food gets here, I'll let you know and I'll let you guys see. So talk to you soon. apologize about that I had more on my itinerary to do but unfortunately due to the time that I went out and then I did have other plans I was not able to really like show you guys what there is to do in the city during the holiday season however stay tuned because I will definitely still do that but in the meantime I wanted to just tell you guys that I came home today and Santa came early yes your girl has been good all year long and then here comes santa wanting to bless me early so i'm actually going to do a unboxing video and i am basically going to unbox something that was sent to me from a company a travel company of course i'm going to tell you about the company tell you about the product so on and so forth so if you want to see what santa brought little old me for christmas then just keep watching package sitting outside my door and I'm not gonna lie you guys I kind of already like ripped the ceiling or whatever but I'm going to unbox it and see what it is so this is from travel wedge so thank you travel wedge for my early Christmas gift in the box comes a mini pump I guess this is like a cover maybe and then I guess this is the actual gift so let's see what's in here it's a cute little bag or whatever Travel wedge pillow. Pillow. Hey. And I think that these are great because I've been wanting one of these for the longest. Basically though, this is like an inflatable pillow that you can literally like take on the go. And it comes with a little mini portable pump. It also comes with a cover. So here is the actual pump guys so you can see that so here are the instructions this is good if you are tall and you might find it more comfortable to add an extra pillow at the end this is good for pregnant people people with acid reflux or if you just want some extra cushion while you travel okay so to inflate you're gonna take the pointy nozzle and the pump and to inflate, you're gonna put it on the side. The top little hole there is to actually deflate. And then there's like a hole on this side, like on the side right there, where I put the nozzle, and that's to inflate. Literally stick the nozzle into the pillow. You connect the nozzle, you press the switch, and then you continue to fill it until it is full. So there's a switch on the pump. So it might be dead, so I might need to charge it. It's dead, but there is a switch right here on the pump. I'm going to charge the pump a little bit, and then I will inflate it. So there's the charger in the pump, and 
then I'm going to find a wall piece and try to inflate it at the end. So I plugged up the pump and I am going to hit the switch and then I'm going to put it in the pillow and inflate it. It's inflating. I know you can't really see it, but it is slowly but surely inflating. So once it inflates more, I'll let you guys see. So the pillow is just about done being inflated. I think I'm just gonna put a little bit more air in it so it's not like squishy. But I don't like my pillows too, too hard, so I might let some air out of it. Okay, I think that's good. So I'm gonna let a little air out. Just, there we go, that's good. And then I'm just gonna put the valve on there so it's tight and it's ready. So now it's actually, comfy so yes i love this i love this you guys and like i said it also comes with a cover so i'm going to put the cover on it so you guys can see yes cover this is super cute and i love this because honestly this is like perfect for like two people could really share this pillow like to put their heads on if they wanted to i love this like pillowcase it's super durable and it looks comfy okay i might not have put it on of that I'm super excited to go try this out so I have no complaints though like I said like it's super comfy the pillowcase is really thick and like it feels like it's a good comfortable material the pillow itself I like that it's not like super hard like that's always my biggest concern when like you get like inflatable things is like I don't want to be uncomfortable you know but this is like really comfy, really, really comfy. And then I like that it's like a pretty good size. Like, you know, you're not fighting, you know, the pillow for headspace. Like you have plenty of headspace, plenty of body space. And I definitely love this. And I love that it's so like just pack worthy. It came with, like I said, this cute little travel wedge drawstring bag. So, when I deflate it, I can just put it back in the bag. I can fold it, put the cover back in the bag, put the pump back in the bag. I can literally just like carry this with me in my luggage. So I love that. It's super easy to transport. It's super easy to blow up. Like I just, I love it. So I have no complaints. You guys make sure 
that you get your own travel wedge pillow and I will link below their website so you can order yours or so that you can gift somebody with a travel wedge pillow for Christmas. I'm about to go try out my pillow, you guys, because I'm tired. I just got off of work. I am tired. And your girl is like ready to try out her pillow, okay? I'm ready to try it out. If you love this video, as always, make sure that you like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure that you share with a friend. Make sure you go get your Travel Witch pillow and that you gift somebody with a Travel Witch pillow. And follow me on Instagram at that me a girl. And I think that's it. So thank you for watching. Happy fourth day of Vlogmas or 25 days of travel. And I'll see you guys in the next video.